welcome to the middle of nowhere. Good place to have some refreshment. Now today we are going to try a beer that I cannot pronounce a single thing about it. Uh, Franzen Connor Weissen beer. Weiss beer. A premium Weiss beer. That's a true. There's literally nothing on this bottle I can pronounce. Nope, in accordance with Bavarian purity law. Nailed it. Hmm. Um. Franzen Connor Natural Trub Premium Hefe Weisenbrauer. Imported by Import Brands Alliance, St. St. Louis, Missouri. Know that one. Uh, 16.9 ounces. Please recycle. I got it, man. I've mastered a second language here. Uh, government warning, blah, 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 blah. Brewed and bottled by Spottenbrau, Munich, Germany. L, one pint, 0.9 fluid ounces. Oh, one pint and 0.9. Uh, uh, not really telling you a whole lot about the beer. Other than the fact that it's imported and got a really cool picture of a monk on it. Friar monk. Dude in the robe. Oh, and it is not a twisty top. Dang, Belgium. But I came prepared. Actually, not sure I didn't come prepared. I just happened to find this. Smells like um, Oktoberfest. If you ever been to one of those outdoor festivals, beer flowing everywhere. This is the overwhelming, you know, stout, straight Pilsner beer. Since 1363. Let's see if it's been good all those years. Really it tastes like every straight off the shelf American beer. Maybe a little on the flat side, you know, if you're familiar with the the convenience store Bud Light, Coors Light, Natty Light, just all that's kind of where you're at. Nothing got a little bit of sour end on the back, but really nothing to write home about. I was expecting a lot more, you know, been around for math years. What, 700 years? 750 six years? You expect more uh, different. Of course, I don't know why you figure if they come up with the recipe, all that you've tasted is really varieties of this more than this being similar to American beer. You know where I'm going with this. It's not in the right home belt. Yeah. It's nothing craft. It's nothing out of ordinary. It's If you want the cool little bottle and kind of impress your friends that you're a connoisseur, this is a cheap way to do it. But as far as quality beer, you can get the same thing. I mean, it's imported to St. Louis. St. Louis got other beers up there. Unless this is your thing that you're wanting to support, Munich, drinking this would just be for show. A little pricier than their American cousins, and really no different. Again, it's more to hang out with the bottle and look pretentious, in my opinion. So, on the uh, pass fail, this is a fail for me. But again, if you want to sit around going, eh, look what I'm drinking. Look at this. <laughs> Knock yourself out. Me. Of course, I say it's a convenience store beer. I bought it at a convenience store. All right. Yeah, drop my lid. Till next time.